camera and back again for another Tweak Time video. I'm here at the VIA headquarters in Taipei. I'm here with Mike. Hi Mike, how are you? I'm doing very well today. Uh, today we brought you in to, to give you a sort of a sneak peek at our new quad-core E-series processors. Uh, we're starting off releasing two mini ITX boards for the embedded market. Uh, here what you're seeing is our APIA M900, which features a, a 1.2 gigahertz uh, via quad-core E-series, and that's paired with our VX900 media system processor. So what we sort of see this quad core being used for mainly in the embedded market is uh, to push the digital signage, you know, HD intensive uh, environments. So as you can see, we have four displays running. Uh, they're all running 720p all off of uh, our via quad core E-series. Uh, within the board itself, we've added in one of our S3 graphics cards, basically just to add the extra display ports. So the, the M900 board features a VGA and an HDMI, so with the extra graphic card we're able to add in a DVI and an HDMI as well. Uh, the 1.2 gigahertz processor, it runs at a TDP of 27.5 watts, but there's actually three SKUs for our E-series processor. There's a, a 1.0, which is 18 uh, watts TDP, so the 1.2 is 27.5, and then we also have a 1.46, which runs at about 47 watts. Uh, they all have over or overclocking abilities, so there's a, a plus series as well that customers can choose from, which basically boosts the 1 to 1.2, the 1.2 to 1.46, and our 1.46 can jump up to 1. .6. How, how does the overclocking feature work on the processors? It's an adaptive, so it'll sort of sense, and if it needs extra power, depending on resource management, it'll, it'll jump up power performance, depending on what you're, you're running. Okay. Well, uh, thank you. Michael, for the introduction. No worries, thank you.